Hi there, and welcome to Stutter 365, the project in which I challenge myself as a person who stutters to make phone calls every day to overcome my fear of stuttering on the phone. And by putting these phone calls online, I hope to inspire other people to overcome and challenge their own fears. So, the thought that I would like to share for today comes from an author by the name of Ralph Blum, or maybe it's pronounced Bloom. Anyway, it goes, Nothing is predestined. The obstacles of your past can become gateways that lead to new beginnings. And I like that one because it, it reminds us that we can use our obstacles or maybe our perceived weaknesses to our advantage. I, I've also heard another thought that goes, in your weakness lies your strength. And I think that can be true. And I know there are many people who stutter out there, like myself, who would like to use this obstacle of having a speech impediment to our advantage. And I know it has taught me to be more compassionate and it has also taught me to want to help people overcome their own challenges because we all deal with some kind of challenge or another and I think that we can use those challenges to help and show other people that it's okay to have these challenges and that they can even help us out in life or at least help us be more compassionate and want to help others. I don't know, I'm, I know that's kind of a rambly uh, thought and an explanation to the, to the quote that I shared, but maybe you can derive a little bit of wisdom out of it. So, okay, on with the phone call now. So in this video, I'm going to call another department store and I'm going to ask if their garden center is open for the season. And then if it is, then I will ask if they have strawberries and what those strawberries cost. Okay, here we go. I guess all associates are busy, so I just have to wait for the next available one to pick up the phone. Hello, yeah, uh, um, um, you'll have to excuse me because I have a speech problem, but, uh, um, I was just wondering if the garden, s s um, s s s s um, s um, center is open for the season? It is? Oh, okay, um, can I be... Uh, uh, yeah, to transfer it over there. Okay. Okay, thank you. I'm being transferred to the garden center. Well, it went to another automated message saying that the associates are busy. When I first answered the phone, I got that automated message saying that all associates were busy. I then asked to be transferred to the garden center and she did that but after about a minute of the phone ringing then it went to another automated voice saying that all associates were busy and that I had to wait. So anyway at least I got to speak to somebody and like I said in my previous video it, it isn't important who I call in these in these phone calls I'm doing. So it's not important if I find out 
if the garden center is open. What is important is that I speak to a person and get that practice, that exposure for desensitization as a person who stutters on the phone. So anyway, well, I thought the phone call was all right when I got a, to speak to that person. Uh, I had so, some trouble. I had one particularly difficult uh, block on center, I think it was, garden center. But other than that, I thought it was an okay phone call. So, all right, thank you for watching. Bye.